having issues today. When am I not having issues? You know what I'm dealing with is I scheduled. I told you guys, I'm actually taking a couple days off and I'm so excited because I'm going to tell myself that I'm just not, other than working out, I'm not doing anything. I'm not going to work. I'm not going to run around doing errands. I'm not going to play catch up. I'm just going to like breathe and maybe like go out to lunch or something with somebody that's not a business appointment. Um, I'm not whining, I'm just very tired, you know. I've been running like 200 miles an hour for 30 days almost straight and I'm utterly beat. And I just feel like I, have, I can't stop because it's just, you know, getting up, working, starting stuff, working out, you know, finishing working, 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 research, working, making calls, making appointments, working, you know, plopping down on my couch at like 9 o'clock at night, trying to relax. Finally last night I was like, I went to go watch a TV show or something, there was nothing on, not even anything on my DVR, which is annoying. And so I'm like, hello, read a book, Kelly. Which by the way, Kelly, I'm reading that book, um, They Did It With Love, I really like that book. Um, so I'm gonna pay attention because I've gotten out of the habit the past couple of years of reading. And then my problem is, is <laughs> all I read are business books. I need to get a little bit more of a life. <laughs> Um, and balance to what I'm doing. So anyway, back to there's mascara on my hand. Um, my hair, I was tell, telling you guys it grows so fast, so I made an appointment to get it cut on Thursday, part of my day off, and my nails done. But it's like, I feel like with this style, when it grows, especially my bangs, like you guys know, my bangs just, they grow so fast. But it's like, I feel like when this hair grows, then it's like, it's almost like it's covering up on my face, but yet it doesn't look good back. So I'm still, I might do a little twist on it next time. There's part of me that says, you know, grow it out to like, you know, not as long as I used to have it, but grow it out. But I just love this. I love the whole having a cut um, instead of just having long hair, you know, long hair. It's just like, everybody has just long hair. It's like, so not that there's anything wrong with it, but I don't know, I'm just, <sighs> like I said, I just need a break. I need to stop running. Because um, that's just, again, I'm not complaining, but that's just like my life right now. It's just running from thing to thing to thing to thing, and then traveling and traveling and traveling and running and working out and fitting this in, and I'm just, I'm beat. I would like a break. But um, I just gotta schedule my vacation. So, anyway, <laughs> other than that, I had a kick butt workout this morning. I did. Uh, Here's the thing, guys, uh, interesting. So this morning I got up, I had my cappuccino, right, that I always have, but I tried a um, two pieces of Ezekiel toast, because some of you had written into me with this whole cramping thing, right, Mr. Flo? Mr. Flo? Um, some of you guys had written in saying that the, the cramping thing can be that you're dehydrated or that you, you know, you just need to have some kind of food. So I had two pieces of Ezekiel toast, and then I waited, um, I did some work and then I waited like two hours. I think I wanted to wait at least two hours from when I got up. Um, and then today was just cardio day. I'm <laughs> really, my hair is really on my nerves. Um, but today was just cardio day, so I, I went to go put Insanity Pure Cardio in. And here's the interesting thing about that. I have a couple of observations. Insanity, you guys know, like when I do Insanity Plyometric Cardio Circuit or what's the other one? Uh, cardio resistance, whatever. I think both of those. They're about 40 minute, um, 40 minute programs. What did I just say? Programs. Uh, programs. And um, I burn. I'm also just going to say for the record, I'm getting a damn tripod this weekend, okay? Because this view is just. I kind of feel like I have to go like this, and I'm just never like right in the picture. Maybe I should stand back. Um, but then that feels like I'm too far away. Hold on, let me try something. Ooh. Haven't figured it out yet. Why do I feel like I have to be like up here? Um, what was I talking about? Oh, so most of the cardio, uh, good God, I can't talk today. Sorry, Amy. Well, Amy's on vacation, so she won't even see me drinking soda. Amy's trying to get me to drink, stop drinking soda. All in due time, okay? It's one of the things I need to get through this period. Um, I'm sorry that I'm very airheaded today. Um, some of you are like, today? Um, 
So anyway, insanity. So I did Pure Cardio, and for those of you that aren't familiar with Pure Cardio, this uh, CD is literally, you do your warm-up, which is about eight minutes, and as you know, for those of you that either have been hearing about um, uh, insanity, you know that even just the warm-up, by the time I finish the warm-up, I've already burned 120 calories. 120 calories in eight minutes, and you're, you're dripping with sweat. So then you do your, um, not cool down, but you're stretching, right? And then what's left of Pure Cardio, is 15 minutes straight. There's no stopping, there's no break. So most Insanity workouts, you do 30 seconds, let's see. You'll do 30 seconds, I'm trying to think if there's breaks in between each one. Maybe you do like three exercises, three or four spurts, you know, of 30 seconds, and then you stop for 30 seconds, and then you'll do it again. Um, so with this one, there's just no stopping. You start and 15 minutes all the way through, your heart rate is, you know, this time I looked at it, I think I was mostly up in like 160. So it's just constant and clearly I could not get through it all the way. My, I have not built up that kind of endurance yet. But what was funny to me is that I think, let's see, so it's 15 minutes, eight minutes in the beginning. So that's about what, 23 minutes and then another five minutes. So maybe it's not as long. Maybe it's more of a 35 minute workout than a 40 minute, for some reason though, I thought it was still 40 minutes. But when I finished that, I was only at 350 calories. So, I mean granted, it's closer to just about 35 minutes, but the other ones, when I get to the end of it, I'm at 500. You guys know, when I post that I did an insanity workout, it's usually 500, 505, 510. And I thought, wow, because this one seems to be like a really more intense workout where you don't stop and you don't have breaks, but I actually burn more calories in the other ones where you stop and you take your breaks and you start again. Just interesting. Um, also, going back to the cramping thing, um, I started off, got through the, um, got through the uh, warm up fine, and then I was in the middle of the workout and I really started to cramp again on my right hand side. So I just made myself drink some more water and it seemed to alleviate it. Um, I just, you know, I'd love to know that I'm not the only one that cramps up like that because trying to do cardio, jumping up and down cardio, running, and, and having to stop strictly because you have so much pain. You guys know, when I'm talking about a cramping that can get so bad, it's like when you stop and you're walking around and you're breathing in and you're going, like you feel that sharp pain, this like sword in your side pain when you breathe in. Like it's not like I'm a wimp and I can't take a little bit of pain. It's a significant cramping. So I'm just, it, it used to be that I, you know, had this very rarely, but I feel like maybe now it's because I'm so paranoid about it. But anyway, I'm working on it. So we'll see. Um, and hopefully I can get over it. And then after that, I did a little bit of cardio abs because again, I just, for me, during this period when I really want to concentrate on um, fat loss, I, uh, no matter what I look like right now, I just don't like it. I'm just having issues. Um, so I did cardio abs after that. And the thing is, I was gonna do a poll today, is, you know, Sean T keeps saying in these, oh, here's on my last one. He keeps saying in the, um, in the uh, video, he's like, we don't even have to do any crunches or sit-ups during this. Like, what's the big deal that people don't like crunches? I, I don't understand. If I'm sitting there and I'm doing ab workout, I'm doing abs. Why does it matter that it's not a crunch? I, like, I don't understand. Maybe it's because in the beginning of, of working out, you know, I don't know, being so ubiquitous, maybe that's all people did for abs was, I'm sorry you guys, I just, I cannot stand this right now. Um, maybe that's all they did was, um, sorry, was, um, crunches, but seriously, like for me, abs is abs is abs. Who cares? There's so many different ways you can work your abs. Standing, planking, on your stomach, on your back. Who cares? I mean, you're still taking the time to do it. So to me, it's like, I, I really don't see what the selling point is to go, hey, we're doing all this ab work and we're not doing any crunches. Who cares? Like, do, do you guys, it, 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 do you have some kind of like aversion to doing traditional crunches, what's the big deal? Like to me, what I really don't like, traditional sit-ups. Because as you know, I think if you're not really concentrating on your form, you can screw up your back. I'm out of time. This has been a very hectic vlog, vlog today. Sorry about that. I'll try to be better tomorrow. And the haircut is forthcoming. <laughs>